Once so you, mm. when you talk about money, mm. how much money can someone potentially make from you? It doesn't matter. It can even go up to 10 million. Let's say a Ugandan. 10 million. 10 million There are people month. getting that. Ooh. Hi guys, Are here. You're welcome to my channel. Today I have a very, very special guest for you guys. He's here. Yes, I'm finally here. Dennis Duke, Uganda is my name. Yes, Dennis, how are you? I'm fine, Rich. How are you? So, I'm okay as well. Are you welcome to my channel? Thank you. I'm, I'm glad I'm, to have you. And I'm really glad to be, sh to be here and uh, to interact with you yes. and your viewers, your yes. audience. Yes. So, Dennis is a YouTuber. Uh, that's how I got to know about him. He's actually one of the best YouTubers around. And he's also a journalist by profession. So, why are you Duke? Is that your birth name? Duke Why is, are you Dennis Duke? Duke is like my stage name, oh, okay. but also my... Right from childhood, right from mm -hmm. high school, mm -hmm. I used to call myself Duke. So people start... In fact, lately, people don't call me Dennis. They call me Duke. Duke, Duke, Duke. So Duke has taken over, and I must say I'm the only Duke of Uganda. Ooh. Have you heard of any? <laughs> no, Except I those that want to, to be like me. One of these, eh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, so uh, we are here. I'm here with Dennis today. Uh, we are going to chat about uh, YouTube, how to have a successful YouTube channel in Uganda, and especially in 2020. Yes, 2020 yes, so is here. Dennis is going to tell us how to have a successful YouTube channel, what it takes, uh, what niches are profitable, how to actually make money off YouTube. Because people are out there thinking, oh my god, you should go to YouTube and make money. Mm. Is it that easy? Is it not easy? So just start by telling us general YouTube in Uganda. Uh, YouTube as a whole in Uganda is not yet appreciated. Okay. But we are starting to appreciate it. I don't know whether you want me to speak in English or Uganda or Unyankolo or Lugeso. Oh my god, I yeah. think we can mix both yeah. English and Luganda. Yes, yeah. so in Tiabantu Abasinga, Tevanava Ku, Chite Gera Brunji, this whole YouTubing thing. In fact, mm. if you told somebody, mm. we have two generations mm. the, the young generation mm -hmm. and the old generation. When you tell a young generation, rather, let's, let me start with the old generation, mm. that you're actually doing YouTube for a living, mm. they'll be like, what is Muzanyanyo, that? Muzanyanyo, yeah. You understand? Yeah. They yeah. won't really they won't understand, understand it, that yeah. it's actually making people, uh, yes. you know, money. Mm. When you get to a younger generation of my age, Who all want to be YouTube. They'll be like, okay, mm. so they think it is, boom, you upload a video, chuk, chuk, you make money, money is, adds, chuk, chuk, money comes money. flowing. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> It's a process. Yes. Uh, just like any other job, just like any other profession, it's something that you've got to build over time. So what is the process? Tell us so step for starters, by step what for starters, YouTube is a Google company. It, it, mm -hmm. it, it belongs to Google as yes. a company, uh, the one that does Gmail. Mm -hmm. So when you have a Gmail account, mm -hmm. you automatically qualify have to have a channel. YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. So you create one. And I then, believe everyone has a Gmail account. Exactly. At least, yeah. Yes. So, yes. So when 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 you create one, you automatically have the platform where you can create content. So YouTube does want to appreciate the energy that we are putting in, the effort that we are putting in to create content. For example. I have today used fuel mm. to come here to meet you. Mm. I have used my camera mm. or our camera. Mm. We have used <laughs> our phones. We have yes. used our That's data. To you understand? Meet, yeah. And 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 the meetup we've mm. eaten. So yes. at the end of the day, you've Make put in effort. costs. Yes. Exactly. So YouTube yes. is like, uh uh, mm. those people, people make shouldn't it. watch for exactly. free. Exactly. Yeah. So let's have a better way of actually making people earn from the platform and that's where they say no let's appreciate youtube content creators and it's the more great idea. yeah the more you create content the more energy you put in the the returns mm. you understand literally now that's why i usually tell people that go for niches that yes I understand when you're starting to be an ascent, eh? mm. now when you go into for a niche that involves so much, sometimes it also pays much. You understand? For example, like uh, for example, uh, when you do skits, comedy, mm. it may take somehow mm. a lot of investment, mm. but the returns are yes, quite Yes, so actually well. I would like to ask, mm. 
because the biggest YouTubers in Uganda, that's Ankansime and Eddie mm. Kenzo, they have mm -hmm. the hugest channels. Mm -hmm. Ankansime is a comedian, that's mm -hmm. entertainment. Yeah. Eddie Kenzo is an artist, that's entertainment. Mm -hmm. Other big YouTubers are actually, they're all entertainers, mm -hmm. you know? Mm -hmm. So is YouTube meant for only entertainment? Absolutely not. Because other not. YouTubers, the mm. ones who also have quite successful channels are into news, mm. which is also entertainment, entertainment sort at of, the end of as the day, well. Gossip yes, news. Yes, gossip. Um, so I'm, those are the big channels and the guys making money. Like, so is meet YouTube meant for all of us in Uganda? Yes, Or it is, is it meant for people with talent or particular niches? Not at all. Do you think an everyday person can go on YouTube? create content and be able to earn a living of YouTube. One thing I must tell the viewers out there is that YouTube is a content creating platform. It gives anybody a platform to create content. It doesn't really care whether you have the talent or not, whether you have passion or not. It is you now to come back and say, okay, what am I talented in? What is it that is different from Ray? What is it different that I am giving my viewers that is different from Uplife? You understand? All these are content creators in Uganda. So once you understand your strength, so that is where your marketing point starts from. Uh, but like I said in the beginning, YouTube has not been well, well, well uh, received in Uganda. We are just trying to learn it, many people. Uh, but the biggest niches that are making people earn big are obvious news, yes. music, mm -hmm. entertainment gossip, mm -hmm. comedy, and some sort of uh, uh, um, sports, you understand? Oh, okay. But sports gossip, news, well. and comedy, mm -hmm. those are the leading. It, so it is would by you default. advise someone, mm. if they are coming to YouTube specifically mm. to make money, to have it as their second are you source of people? income, mm. what would you advise them to do? Don't come on YouTube. But if I'm not a talkative person, don't come I can't to YouTube do to make. Don't come to YouTube to make money. But it's a money-making platform, and yes. there are no jobs in Kampala. Yes. I usually tell people that when you're coming to YouTube, come as something where you find fun, mm. something you enjoy to do, the money is just added. You understand? Like, money is <laughs> obviously, it, you will reach so there. come for fun, right? Come for fun, yeah. you will reach there when there's money. Because I don't want to tell somebody that, hey, mm. come to YouTube and get money. Because yeah. there are people who've been frustrated. One month, two months, they're not seeing anything. Like, yes. you, you like yes. me, you understand? Yes, so I want people to come here because they love the platform, first of all. They love to create content. Mm. So that when they create content, when you create content, it is automatic. You have to get to that stage where you start earning. Come to YouTube to have, have your, fun. For have fun, eventually the money will come in. Okay. Mm. So uh, Dennis has a, a YouTube channel. That I have gives YouTube channel. Yes. The main one that we know, uh, Dennis yeah. Duke Uganda. You should check it out and also subscribe to his channel. Mm. So I noticed that you post quite frequently. For mm. example, yesterday you posted two videos on YouTube. In fact, if I had the third or fourth, I would still post it. You'd still post it. it. Mm -hmm. So I find creating videos very time consuming. I don't know if it's because we have different niches of no. channels. Mm. So how do you manage to create two videos in a day? Because editing videos is a lot of work yes. and it consumes a lot of time. So how do you do that? Like I told you, in fact, yesterday you only saw two. There are days I post four. In mm. fact, previously I would even post five, depending mm. on how the news uh, wow. are happening in the day or is happening. Mm. Uh, like I told you, when you come to YouTube to make money, it's a bit different than when you come to YouTube to make to, to, to because it's a passion, mm. it's something that you want or you love doing mm. or you love to do. Mm. So when you come here with passion, you will feel it. Like you will feel like, okay, let me create about this. Let me create about this. like. Like ideas will be flowing, mm -hmm. but when you come here for money, you'll be stagnant. When you don't see the be money, you'll be frustrated, and before come. you know it, you've yeah. opted out. Mm -hmm. But also, I usually tell people that when you're choosing a niche, mm -hmm. make it a point to choose a niche that is that you're very conversant with, mm -hmm. a niche that won't give you a hard time in creating content. For example, mm -hmm. I cannot do makeup. No, Even if you not. taught me how to do makeup, I can't because it's can't not where it. I feel. Yeah. It's not my passion. Mm -hmm. Even if I was to do it for money, I can't mm -hmm. because I don't feel it. But I feel like, okay, entertainment, I can do it. I can talk about Kenzo, I can talk about Rema, I can talk about Which anybody. Which brings me to my next question. Mm -hmm. So you have, you have been a journalist. Mm -hmm. uh, you're right now mm -hmm. self-employed. Mm -hmm. First of all, mm -hmm. 
you had a very nice job, we'd assume. What is for. nice? <laughs> what is nice in that? We assume, I'm going to assume uh -huh. you had a very good job uh, working for NBS TV, which is a good company. Mm. I believe anyone who's maybe in a profession like that would like to work with I wouldn't want to go So to first tell us, why would you leave your nice job? Mm. Because YouTube is something you can do part-time, mm -hmm. right? Mm. And still be able to do your normal job. Mm. So why, briefly, why would you leave yes. your job? to focus. Basically. First of all, I don't advise people to leave their jobs okay. mm -hmm. until they are very stable, mm -hmm. until they really feel like, okay, now this is bringing in, this has become my main, main, main job. Mm -hmm. I don't want to particularly mention the station I have worked with because I've worked with a couple of stations. Okay. I've worked with WBS, I've worked mm -hmm. with Urban TV, NBS, some other radio stations that I won't mention for mm -hmm. purposes of privacy. So you have quite a good experience. Yes, exactly. So when, when, when you look at one of the things that I usually tell people that the jobs that people call nice, I don't mean to say that mm. these places have not been paying me well, mm. they've been paying me well, mm. but the nice in that context may not be nice in the paycheck. Okay. So you reach a level when you have to uh, mind about, yes, uh, career development, but also survival. While it's true you're progressing in career wise, your survival is low. What would you? What would it uh, mean for me to be working at BBC, mm -hmm. but I don't have a car? How I'm, is I'm, that I'm, possible? It's very possible because um. of the little paycheck. But what? How would you feel if I told you I work at I work full time YouTube, mm -hmm. but I have a car, and the car is so one? The, and, I wouldn't and believe that you're going to work at BBC and mm. not have a car. Mm -hmm. Yes, it's because that is the perception that people have. You understand? I used BBC for example, mm -hmm. but we all know our media houses in the country yes. don't pay that much. Okay. Not only media houses, but the country at large. Yes, Rachel, that's very it is very actually. difficult for you now to get a job of one million plus in Uganda. Yeah, exactly. In fact, most people that I see around town, they are working for 700. Yes. Me, I can't work for that. Yeah, I can't work for one million. Yeah, okay, can't. I'm not bragging. And no, but you're I, right. I, I can't, can't work for one million. Yeah, it's, it's little money. You get yeah. because one million that means my rent may be four hundred. Mm. You have six hundred. I have a child. Food. You have a child. I, I need. Okay. If you're my girlfriend, I need to buy your makeup. <laughs> I buy before you know makeup. it. Before mm -hmm. you, no, that that gentleman <laughs> you are having is reckless. He doesn't know how to treat you. I'm single. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> when you talk about money, how much money can someone potentially make from you? It doesn't matter. It can even go up to. 10 million. Let's say a Ugandan. 10 million. 10 million. There are people getting that. Ooh, yes. that's a lot of money. But for, of course, for starters, you can start from 500, 400, 500, 600. 000. No, yeah, 1,000. Mm. 1 million, 2 million. The channel is getting 3 million, 3.5. Wow. Yeah, depends on how so that's much you. quite a good income. Yeah, you but know, for that, a Ugandan. But like I said, mm. choosing a niche that makes money is quite hard mm. but also you may choose a niche that may not look to be making money in the, in the short term Start, but in yeah. the long run it does so yes, that's once right. you make people understand the kind of content you're creating the better i also think youtube is actually a very long term investment True. because these videos we keep on your platform for the next five years or even 10 years 20, 20 years yes. so we might not be making money today yeah, but because ugandans are not watching a lot of youtube exactly but would actually be surprised five years from today ten yes. years from today and, yeah. when the videos that we are making right now start bringing in a lot of money that happens so i realized that about youtube and i was like you know what you just keep working mm -hmm. even if you don't have a very popular niche mm -hmm. five years from today because the world is evolving it's you growing, just need to, to, yeah. to, to, to grow your brand Yes, yes, the thing exactly. is grow your brand, yes. get your work out there mm. and actually don't look at YouTube as the only content creating platform because YouTube is just one mm. but it has a, a number of things that you can do with it. For example, you can get brands. So brands come sponsor your content yes. and you get that money. In fact, that's where I'm looking forward to. So that's when you've reached the level of an influencer. Exactly. Yeah. So what happens is before you start earning, you must have 1,000 subscribers, yes. 4,000 watch hours. Those are the qualifications. What are 4,000 watch hours? Of like people have watched your content for 4,000 watch hours. Those are 240 minutes. Exactly. 240,000 minutes. Exactly. Which is quite a lot of time. Of time? Yeah. Yes. But they want to encourage you to create content. Yes. And work so, hard as well. Exactly. Yeah. Nothing comes that easy. No, because not. even me talking <laughs> about now, mm. I'm at 33 subscribers soon making 34. 34,000. Yes. And you've done this in how long? In a year's time. Wow, yes. 33,000 subscribers in, in one year. Yes. How do so, you do that? Um, 
it's 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 really really work. So meaning it's very possible that you can actually hit a hundred thousand by even in a month. Actually. Even in a month, yeah. yes. It but depends on the content. It's so funny, yeah. Bec it, it, it really depends on the content that you're putting out there. For example, if you're putting trending content, mm. you're very likely, yeah, that's true. most probably going to get more numbers. Yeah. So if I may ask, mm -hmm. you have been a journalist for the last, I guess, a good number of years. About seven or ten. About seven or ten years. Mm -hmm. And then your channel is also news. Mm -hmm. So do you, would you say that having a journalism background, maybe you already know how to create news, mm -hmm. edit, use film, mm -hmm. shoot, cameras, all the gear, do you think it kind of gave you an upper hand towards making your YouTube channel? For me, it Because is. if someone is starting from scratch, if you've been in a different field like me, uh, business, uh, makeup, I studied BBA. So when I get into cameras, photography, it's editing, yeah. it's a strange world and you start from scratch. Do you think in a way it was a bit of an advantage to you? Did it help you? Yeah, in it any did way? because I mean, I have the experience in terms of camera. I have the experience in terms yeah. of editing, I have the experience in terms of presenting oh because God. that even gives people a time. Okay. I, have, uh, uh, I have a background or experience in marketing, in yeah. promoting, so all that is what I got from the TV experience. I can tell, yeah. I can but tell. it is not limited. I mean, you could wake up in the morning, learn the software because I do even teach people how to join YouTube, how mm. to edit, but that's a package of about $200. So I give somebody that package, if they are willing to pay, they pay me for two weeks, I teach them, they get started. I've done that for a couple of times, I've met a number of people who have paid and I've trained them. So it's not something that is rocket science really, you can learn it today, So it's tomorrow. about learning? Exactly. How and much effort you're willing to invest? Thank you, because yeah. every day is learning day. You don't just say, okay, mazebi no, njize, maze no. No. no, you keep learning, you keep, learning. Even you keep, keep changing, learning. Yeah. you keep you keep innovating. That's why every time you upgrade mm. the software, yeah. it's because the other one is outdated. Mm. So even you, you need to upgrade yourself, get new skills, get like just any other normal job. Okay, yeah. Mm. So I think we've already understood how to start a YouTube channel. Mm. We've also noted that it's not all about making money. Mm -hmm. You should actually be very passionate about it. Mm. If you come with the intention to make money, for you're most likely to be frustrated. For people who yeah. want to join the TV industry, I see a lot of girls, Hi, Dennis, can you connect me to a TV? Mm. Can you connect me to a radio? Mm. I'm like, man, calm down. You have YouTube. Yes, Create it's a free content, platform. Yes, become definitely. famous on YouTube. When as the young, I actually wanted to be a TV you. presenter. Radio yeah. and TV will look for Yeah, you. that's true. Like actually. here, you even practice. Yes, you even practice, become better. Yes. You, you have your own camera. When NBS, you create your own viewers. Yes, yeah, that's true. you have your own platform. You yeah. create your own fan base. Mm -hmm. Such that once you start, when once NBS or, or Urban TV wants to employ you, mm -hmm. You will have the basis you have to something set to show a price. Actually. Yes, exactly. Yes. You'll be like, guys, know you want me to work with you, I need yeah. 4 million, yeah. like 5 million per month. And mm. I'm like, okay. If they look at your content, you're exactly. like so good at it. Yes. Yeah. That's, yeah. And, and for Kenya and Tanzania, it's a different story because for them, their YouTube mm. game is up high yes, there. Yes, it's way higher than yours. Guys, exactly. you are doing so badly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, actually, when I started on YouTube, I only knew Kenyan YouTubers, surprisingly. Me too. I was following American YouTubers, Mutuko, Kenyan YouTubers, they were, they were, I just got the New Life Gardens, family, yes, Joanna Kinithia, Joanna Kinithia um, who, Nasimai, Vix, Maxim, Maxim, Vix, Maxim Wabosha, who, the Wabosha, are quite many, there are very many, and doing so well. Uh, the who, there is this lady I've forgotten, she recently got a TV job, mm -hmm. I've forgotten her name, oh God, when I remember I'll tell you, mm -hmm. but I mean they've taken this whole YouTubing stuff to yeah. another level. But I think we're also progressing as well. Yeah. yeah. I'm very hopeful, really. Yeah, people are embracing YouTube. In about two or three months or three years, mm. we will be. Yeah, we'll I think we are there. good, really. So if you want to start, you can start right now. It's never too late. Mm. But don't do it as a full time thing. No. Just do it on the side. You can only do it full time free. When, yeah. you, when you hit the limelight. Yes. yes. When you're certain you're going to make a stable income out yes. of YouTube. Yeah. So, uh, Dennis, uh, your final words. Thank you for hanging out with us. Thank but you. But before also. you leave, mm. Tell us anything about yourself that we don't know. Anything nice, juicy, spicy. I am born again. Ooh, he's Many born people again. don't know that. Okay. They see me making yapping look on YouTube <laughs> yes, and they are playing around Google. and they're like, mm -hmm. does this guy really even born go to again, church? Christian. I'm a born again Christian. I pray from Victor Christian Center. I'm a okay. proud son of Joseph Serrata, mm -hmm. Bishop Joseph Serrata. He's okay. my spiritual father. Mm -hmm. And um, I'm a father of one. 
but I call myself a father of two because there's some child I took on, so mm. he's literally like my own. Mm. Not like my own, but he's my own. Mm. I'm not yet married, mm. but I want to get married, maybe hopefully okay. very soon, okay. so that I stop beating around the bush, <laughs> so that I start, you know, claiming somebody. I'm a Someone's married wife. To, I'm married to to to. So to so and so, so, yeah. so that they can also feel empowered and proud of having me as their husband. But I'm a future husband, <laughs> very promising one on that. Oh Lord. I am uh, Mugisu by tribe. Yeah. So uh, that was Dennis Duke. I thank you for hanging out with me. Sure. Yeah. Anytime you need me, I'll be very much willing to share. Definitely. Then you can make a lot more videos too. This was a lot of fun actually, and very easy. Easier than doing a makeup tutorial at least. Thank you. <laughs> Yes, yeah, so guys, uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel and also to Dennis's channel. I'm going to put a link in the description. Make sure you subscribe and also, I uh, thank you so much for watching and see you on my next video. Bye. Goodbye. We love you. Take care. <laughs>